This is going to be about turning text into video using AI. There are too many people that upload content about this topic and there are too many methods that you can do this, but I will show you one of the methods, but you have to keep something in mind. With AI, you can't generate like full video, full one hour, 20 minutes or 10 minutes or five minutes video, but you can create or you can generate frames that you can get all of them and merge together and create your own video. So I'll show you how to do that today on this video. Let's get straight into it without losing any more time. Okay, as you can see, I'm in a website that is called Hugging Face and this is a model that can convert text into videos using artificial intelligence. So there are too many models that you can do this but here I found this one which is might be the easiest one for you to start right now. Hugging Face is a huge platform where people, companies and everyone upload their large language models or data sets and models and data sets for AI. A model is a huge database, it's not actually this database, it's a different type of format but it's a place where all these words all this knowledge all these languages sentences are saved and these all of this information is got from a source which is a website newspaper or books or whatever it is AI does in this model it just we give a prop to the model and the model is going to search uh, in this huge place of the keywords and then when it find a keyword is going to generate another one and then based on the, the new sentence is going to generate another keyword another word and it's, it's going to continue like this and in the end it will give you a sentence and this sentence is human readable is like natural language and this is called natural language processing I'll find I'll get more knowledge about this topic and I'll upload videos about natural language processing with Python which is very interesting and a lot of people search about this right now and then after all of this is generated it give it to us so this is a what a model is and a data set is like the the place with the data where um uh all the data that are generated or scraped from somewhere. This is how it works. Okay, so now to generate our video, what we're gonna do? First, we are going to the chat GPT or any AI that you want. And then we are going to generate a story and we'll ask them to give all the frames of the prop frames that you can use for the AI. So I'm gonna give the input. Okay, so I give an input uh, to the chat GPT, which is generate a short story that I can use to generate frames of a video with text to video AI. Give me all the props that I can use for these frames. And also keep in mind that the AI doesn't remember what was the last prompt. This AI doesn't remember what was the last prompt. And for example, if you give an input like Ben is this one, is this person and is doing this thing. And the next uh, input is going to be like Ben is doing another thing. It doesn't know who Ben is is in the second prompt. So this is why I give this uh, command. So here is a story that is generated by GPT-4 and it gives you all the props too. So for the first frame, it gives you the forest frame and I'm going to copy this. So I'll just copy and we'll go to hugging face. So here is the platform where we can find the models and just click on the models. And here you can find too many categories that you can can do. And we're going to click on text to video. So here on text to video, there are too many models that you can use. But for now, we'll just use this one by, by dance. And you can use these models directly in your code. But I'll show you in the next tutorial how to code language uh, models. And you can just directly use use this but uh, for now the, this model has a link that you can access a demo link so here on demo just click on demo and it's going to open this website where you can put the prop and it'll generate the video here so what we're going to do is going to paste this prop that we just copied from gpt and then you just click on run this is going to generate the video right now here and it's going to be a two second frame video that we can use okay so here is the first frame and I'm going to download it. Then I'm going to do the same thing for all other frames. Okay, so now we got all the frames downloaded and here I can find all the frames that are two seconds each of them. I'm now what I'm going to do is just to merge them. So I'll open Premiere Pro. You can use any program that you have for video editing, create a new project, put a name. And now I'm going to drop the media here and here you got all the frames. So I'm going to drop them all in the timeline and we got the video here. But also I'm going to put some transition between all of these frames and make them slower. And also I'm going to put a zoom on each frame. So 
each frame is going to zoom a little bit. Okay, so what I did, I put some zoom on each frame. So each frame has a zoom. Also, the transition is going to be between each frame. Sometimes it zooms, sometimes it shakes to make more uh, impressive and more attractive to the eye of the human. So here we got the video, the, the final video. And it's just a quick video that is generated by AI. So basically, it's not going to be something very perfect, but still you can use it for something. And also you can put the voice uh, over it and then then it, you can create a short story that you can post on your TikTok. So I'm going to uh, export it. Just click on file and go to export media and export. And here we got the video. Okay, guys, this was the video for today. Please smash the like button if you like this type of content with AI. And the next video, I'll show you how to create the natural language processing using Python. So if you're interested, it's a very interesting topic that you should join. Enjoy this video and learn a lot. So see you in the next one.